All right, all right. It's nothing spectacular, but like it's it's workable. Yeah, I don't have to deal with fuses. This is like a big, this is a big. And on this first floor, I can kind of hammer that into my skull. No, this is gonna be a good space run because the pilot run wasn't good. So as we know, pilot is a space pilot and he leaves all of his waste in space. Because of this, when I play as space, it's just full of waste all the time. It's bad, because the pilot is just junking the place up. But since the pilot wasn't doing so much of that, this time we're blessed. This will be good space. Yeah, I didn't used to remember to put out fuses because, well, I didn't have to deal with fuses all the time. It's not always a constant search when you deal with fuses like a couple times a day to be like, wait, do I have something that shoots liquid? So yeah. It was a different time. Ah, now I'm a true convict. Not the most exciting of guns. Uh, this room can... can just not. Oh, I got own. This room's actually hard when stuff is jammed. And I hate it. Anyway, I just need to find the shop and then I can, you know, get my health back. Need a Molotov, yeah, and then, you know, that item that you can get. I thought it would be there. Oh, well, I've got my health back anyway. Sadly, that wasn't a high dragon fire, which, well. I want Chad's amulet. Hopefully I can get Chad's amulet. How much was, was Chad's amulet? 90, that's expensive. I think I'll be able to get to 90 though. I believe in Chad. See, look at this, we're, we're gaming. Oh, frick. Couldn't you have not done this? That's enough money to get the amulet of Chad. I'll get a gold junk. But I want to open it. It could be Gunder Fury. Uh, go buy Chad's amulet. I already found the secret room too, which is sad. Could be a box, but it could be Gunder Fury. Or maybe it'll be the black hole gun to my tentacle from last run. Which is what I'm expecting. Man, remember the other day when I was when I had 
the Rubidine. Nope. And I fed the evil muncher and it gave me the Mark II and I called it. And I knew it was gonna happen all along and I just, I did it anyway. Dark Marker is an S tier, I think. Key, please. Why are you like this? Why, why are you like this? There's, I found a secret room and it's just, it's just not meant to be. This hurts me as much as it hurts you, Red Chest. And so you know, gold junk isn't any more likely or less likely from any different tier of chest. You just need to break a red or black chest to unlock it. And you can have already opened that chest too, uh, for the unlock. Look, it was definitely Gunder Fury. Definitely. No doubt. That's why I'm sad about it. At least I finally did max Gunder Fury. It did show up enough for that. Also, since I now have the poison gun that's, like, actually worthless, I can use the, um, fish barrel if I need... people shooting at me here. Nope, I knew it. I like the typo on teleported. How much are you? I would like to buy you. I don't know what that quote was from. I don't think I was there for that one. Right, maybe that wasn't a typo, and that's why it's a quote. I don't even think it's that funny, though. I don't get it. Wait, this looks very suspicious. It's apparently not very suspicious, though, so...
you can't call quotes by ID, but quote 6969 is not in here. We didn't get it. I don't know who has it at the moment. But I bet it's B-Rex. Austin has more? Well, maybe it was Austin. No, not butt spot. <laughs> What does that even mean, HD Jump? What does that even mean? Wow, I almost walked into a bullet there. Thank you. Uh, nope. Walk away slowly. For now. What did this run start with? It started with the, um, barrel and the antibody. And the convict pistol. So like very not special, but not like terrible. Because it means I don't have to deal with fuses from the start. Not that there were any. And uh, I can heal when I end up hurting myself. Thank you, that was just so valuable to me. How did you know? Oh wait, I can go buy boss kill gun. This helps me immensely. I could get rid of, see, I could get rid of these two, but then I don't have like this to use for rooms and I really want that to use for rooms. I need to see if I get a gun. Like I, I can do it if I get a gun that's okay for room cleaning. One day. I'll kill you eventually. Okay, I've done it. No, it's a city by default. It upgrades as you get multi shots and stuff like that. Once you have like triple shot or the synergy that gives a triple shot, that's when you become like a conglomerate. Because at that point, it's not just that there are a lot of you there, it's that there are a lot of you there, you're monopolizing uppercuts and you, you know, it's a real business, it's efficient. It's not just a city, you know? of uppercut enthusiasts. The uppercut enthusiasts society or community. These are probably already things that are, uh, what, initialisms? And I, I thus should come up with something else. But I just, I don't know. I do like conglomerate when it's, when it's real, real optimized and busy.
But uppercut's one word, not two words. But I suppose that if you do UCEC, -E you could call it the U kick if you're one of those kinds of people. Upco. <laughs> Alright, please stun. Thank you. Well, that is just not helpful. Oh, but I did get a key, so that's fantastic news. That is not fantastic news. Anyway, I can open both of these, so good news. Oh, terrible news, terrible news. This is the worst news. This is the worst timeline. But that is a pretty good one, uh, just because I get another blank. Having four blanks is nice, and one of them is Chad's amulet, so. Chad's looking out. Why is this gun so bad? I would have rather had the um, sawed off. My life would have been way better like that. I know I already found a secret room on this floor. Can you reword that question? I assume you just mean start with their secondary, their primary secondary guns and one of their items. Like, you can't spawn with the use item as far as I know, so you can't really get a convict spawn. Because uh, you can't get the um, Molotov. If you're me, it feels not that unlikely because I just get bad items instead of good items. bought the key just like on principle on instinct and I was like wait a second I don't have money yet stun the guy that I want to stun. This gun runs through its ammo really fast. Can No, space can totally pet the dog. Gunslinger can pet the dog now. I was just doing it on the, the first run today where I was playing as the gunslinger. I don't know when they made that the case, uh, but uh, they did. I know, right? Finally, this game is a functional game. <laughs> what a time to be alive. Yeah. Yeah. 
This gun is better not to charge, by the way. Like, it does more DPS. If any enemy could electrify water, that would be scary. I would be, like, not into that. That guy running into me is like one of my fears. Nice. Secret room in the room before. Like in here? So there is. Why? Like why? Who who does this? My feelings just, they, they hurt. I just want more useful secret rooms. Can I have a passive item that's, you know, more useful secret rooms? Poison immunity. I'm down with this. Uh, so that means gun and don't know. Oh, this guy. His dark red laser. Uh, yes. And I'm immune to poison. This is great. This is a combination right here. showed up anyway. Isn't that interesting? Alright, I will open the random. That's actually really nice to get. Yeah, no curse bullets for me. But you know what? I don't exactly want curse bullets right now. So this is nice because it's immunity to all floor damage effects and it's immunity to pits. Oh, and it's immunity to um, spider webs, which aren't a damage effect, but are a floor effect. Yeah, when you're holding the siren, you can fall into pits and it does not matter. I'll show you after I kill this guy. See, just doesn't matter. I don't know why the siren has that effect, but like I'm not gonna complain about it. No! Don't! Can you just don't? 
Okay. It, it don't didn't. I don't know how much money I had before that, but I think I profited. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure I came here and I was broke, and after a handful of rooms, I was still, like, moderately broke, and now I am not all that broke. So... game can suck it. Check the replay. All right. So we've got we've got like a sports desk here. Let's review Let's review the play. You profit. Uh, I should... Not. Uh... Okay. No, you don't have to do key manip anymore. Every shop except the shop on the forge, the fifth floor, is guaranteed to have at least one key. No, they changed it past that, uh, so that every floor, not just the first and second floor, always have a key. Because removing key manip and not having every shop have a key would be really bad. It was really bad. At least, it was really bad when they said that the reason they did it was they wanted to make the game more reliable and giving you what you need. So like, yeah, they upped key drop rates, but they're not nearly high enough for not having at least one key in every shop. If they had said, you know, we just, we don't want that, and didn't say they wanted it to be more reliable, sure, whatever, that's fine. You do you. You might not agree with it, but at least, you know, if you're consistent, then fine. But since they said they wanted it to be reliable, they made the wrong call. <laughs> Lock shops, they're my favorite. Don't miss those. Yeah, I just had the the Mimic shoot the wall for me so that I didn't have to check. Alright, so I can sell the heck out of this gun. I was going to use Dark Marker for the boss. How attached to Screen Shake am I? Extremely. We're like lovers. I don't think spikes are a floor damage effect that you're immune to with the siren. Just as a heads up in case you were going to say it. Okay, so I have enough keys for everything. Screen Shake loves me too, yes. Tui, thank you for the seven months with Prime. Thanks so much. 
Wait, is this chest locked? Or is this chest never locked? I'm gonna do this next floor. <laughs> you think that you're attacking me, but you're not. How attached to your eyes are you? Not much, that's good. I was worried that you might need them later. the synergy chest now always a synergy frick get out stop it I'm over you no means no I mean, Chamber Gun is likely for synergies because you have, you know, multiple master rounds, and I assume that having multiple synergies for one gun make that gun more likely. Yes, the room with the altar for the crest can spawn... Okay. Can spawn next to a locked room, so you can have to have a key to get to the secret floor. I didn't roll in time. Oops. I also don't know if you're immune to those, but that's fine. <laughs> yes, hands are not a floor hazard. That was not the roll direction that I was looking for. Chad's amulet is looking out for me though, freezing the lads. <laughs> Paul was on top of things, what are you gonna do? Why does it keep doing this to me? Why can't I just be happy? Tomorrow's not a good time to be out of money until. But it's a better time than the next day, or the day after. Hmm. 
Mm, I should fill the dark marker. At this point, I won't use this here because there's not really much reason to. Where's the trapdoor on the minimap? That's how you get to the rat floor. Uh, which is a secret boss floor that was added a little while ago with advanced Gungeons and Dragons. I always go to it though, so don't worry, you'll see it. Wait, they buffed Artificer? How'd they buff Artificer? Tell me more. Put this information directly into my eyes. Artificer will be able to hover by holding jump. Oh, that's a good passive. Yeah, that's a good passive. It doesn't really fix the problems that I had with, you know, the three and the four, but it's a good passive. Yes, spread the knowledge like butter on my brain biscuit. I think they also buffed everything else of hers? Oh. Well, I mean, I, I think that the flamethrower needed fundamental change. Just because of its limited range and how bad that is late game. Or to be able to move while still using it. Like, to actually use movement while it's still active. And maybe cancel it by using it again instead of by using anything else. Something like that would be good. Um, that would be a good compromise. Yes. Um, and I don't know. The wall, I want more. I want more out of the wall. Is Mercenary being buffed too? Why would they buff Mercenary? Mercenary's great. the wall needs to block projectiles necessarily it would be nice that would be like really good but I don't know maybe that's not it I have a lot of money this run they made fast shooting characters procs weaker and slower shooting characters procs stronger interdasting very lucky with uh, that effect, I guess. I don't know if I'd want skills 2.0 to be an alternate set of skills, but like what else could it be, I guess? I don't really know. I, I don't know what I'm feeling as far as what skills 2.0 should be. Oh, this gun's so much better too because of Chad's amulet. Thank you, Chad. Oh, that hit me. It's so hard to be like reliable about when that's gonna hit you and when it's not. reduction. I can open everything now. Never. Never. 
Uh, I, I could make more money, but I just don't care. So I'm just not gonna spend that on her. I have enough. I know, right? Didn't I already sell this this run? <laughs> Hello? I have a synergy with the Dark Marker with um, Antibody. And that makes it good without charging it. I mean, here's the thing, like, it would be weird to me if skills 2.0 were just, we replaced all the skills to make them different. That would make no sense to me. So having it as, now everyone has two sets of skills, that also sounds weird to me, but maybe it would be fine. I don't really know how it would work. Um, like, it, it could be in such a way as it doubles the character count, or maybe you can mix and match between their two sets, so you can have just the four and passive that you want. Maybe it would be something else like that, but I just, I just don't know. It's really... It just seems like a weird implementation to me. Oh, yeah, I deserve that. Oh, I'm on fire. But I do look forward to everyone just, you know, having a passive. God, I'm really good at this game. Did you all know that? been owned. Uh, I don't think that it's a game where you're meant to not have to worry about damage dealing items. If you didn't need items to be successful, it would be kind of pointless. Like, I don't know. Because it's not the same kind of game as this. You can be successful in this game without items if you really want to be. Like, you could do a no item starter gun only anytime you want. But this is a very different kind of game. In Isaac, you can do that, but you can't really do that, you know? Like, it's, it's not normal, I think, for it to be like a reasonable thing not to have items.
Oops. Why did I... The secret to punch out is first phase, you do a back dodge for everything. Second and third phase, you block everything except like that attack. As long as you know how to get super for the unblockable ones otherwise. These are... what? These are the synergy, aren't they? Shouldn't I be looking into chests right now? <laughs> and these charmed bullets. I only got four keys because I messed up the super at the end of the first one. But that doesn't really matter. Charm bullets are pink goo on. What am I what am I using? I'm using this, cause screw it, I got it. I think literally everybody wants the ancient scepter back from Risk of Rain 1. Like literally everybody, there's not a single person who would say, nah, we don't need that. Like, I'm sure they'll add it eventually. Like, Wicked Ring, I can see the argument for not adding back. Even though it's awesome and everyone likes it. But Ancient Scepter, no. They have to add Ancient Scepter. If they don't add Ancient Scepter, I'll tell you that I'm going to eat my hat and then I won't do it. I also don't own a hat, so I wouldn't even have to do it in the first place. survivor. Well, I mean, what would you do solo? Like, did any of the characters in the first game fit your idea of that at all? Okay. Yeah, but Shotgun Full of Love doesn't suck, and Shoppo does. Shoppo is so much more inaccurate. And doesn't bounce.
they're adding what would basically be blights. Terrifying. Tell me more. <laughs> Oops. You just said that they're elite elites? Okay. Another amulet. I'm in there. I think they also said they have a stop player healing effect. That's that doesn't sound good. That sounds not that that sounds unfair. Well, I was gonna teleport to the shop when I found everything except the shop, but then I found the shop, so I didn't. And I'm gonna teleport to the shop on the next floor. And it's also very useful for bullet hell, because you can use it to get to the um, first room when you pick the wrong path. Not all just one type, but like still, that sounds like a pretty silly effect to give an enemy. Oh, that's nice. This game does have a lot of shotguns. Like in the Ammonomicon, it's just page after page after page of shotguns. Uh, like the physical one, I was I looked through it when I got it because they sent me one and it was cool. But it's just shotgun after shotgun after shotgun. Oh no, I don't have the keys for this. Oh, game, please just help me more. I always say when it's uncertain, and Winchester, when it's uncertain, um, oh, I got keys, so it's fine. Uh, I picked the green chest over the blue chest when I don't know if either of them is a gun or non-gun. suck. Alright. I was going for, um, 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 that. I was going for that. So, basically, my master plan was amazing and perfect, and I, I got it. One day you might understand what it's like to plan so far ahead, so effectively, uh, but 
I understand if it's not today. Alright, I'm good. See? Always have the map every time. That was really good planning. Now I can get three-fourths gun knight. Shoutouts to me. For always being there. Whether I want him to be or not. your fire. Fire's a nerd. Mm, this is good because it won't miss. So it's gonna be like maximally ammo efficient. It's doing its best. Shoutouts to doing your best. And it seems when this multi hits, it does regenerate ammo, even though it already may have generated that ammo. So that's pretty cool. It's okay, I just see Celsius and I'm like, I guess that's probably pretty hot. Like at all times. Zero degrees Celsius, definitely pretty hot. I'm not sure I could handle it. Negative 40 degrees Celsius, okay, that one I know because it's the same as negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit. So pretty hot. Sure you'll be able to watch me in Korea, you just have to have a really backward sleep schedule. Or a sleep schedule so forwards that it seems backwards. That's also an option. Oops. But I mean, hey, in Korea you can smell cigarettes everywhere, I think. I think that's a thing.
but also arcades. And they're cheap. I was not looking, to be honest with you. Nope. Yeah, that wasn't the right shrine. Well, I mean, it's okay, HD Jump. They have, like, every game instead of just a few games like the US. Or like no games like most of Europe. I guess they have internet cafes and stuff in uh, Korea. I, that's something that I just, you know, it's so foreign to me. I can't imagine. Yeah, so I, I used to go to Texas to go to round one before they were any, like anywhere, and it was funny to me that both of them were in the same general area, like an hour apart. When I went to California recently for um, for the Borderlands 3 event, <laughs> there were like four round ones, each an hour away in a different direction from where I was staying, and I was like, man, <laughs> why isn't it like this everywhere? Like, I could turn any of these into a thing. Um, space is a bit more of a high priority type skin uh, than the transformations. Like, I know that your hands get messed up. Like, my hands, when I'm a uh, crime squad leader, turn white instead of blue. And, like, stuff is weird. Dude, I am just not getting any ammo this run, and it just doesn't make me happy. Why did I roll that way? I don't know, like, most of them HD jump? Just <laughs> try them all. Uh, yeah, that's exactly what it is. You order digital food and you download it into your stomach. God, I wish I could do that. And I wouldn't have to eat. Gee, I should munch something, I guess. <laughs> I, I don't want to get rid of something I have ammo for. It's only a blue chest gun, but whatever. You like eating? I mean, that's cool. You do you. If I have to use the judge, I'm going to be a sad boy. I have some boss killers, so it's not like the worst fate out there right now.
What's wrong with the judge? It's fine. It's just not amazing or anything. It's not like special fun good times. Okay, that's what's left in this shop, so that's... <laughs> We're like, where's the ammo though? Hello? Those are touching. Like, can, can you... Like, they're touching. What's wrong with the glove? It has curse and is really bad? So it's got two problems. Uh, but since I have nine curse, because I do cursed runs every run, uh, I am more than half a curse, which the only thing that'll give me only half a curse is the first time I use spice. Uh, so anything that has curse except for the first use of spice will spawn Lord of the Jam for me, and I don't want that. Yeah, the super from the glove does like 300 damage or something, right? It's like a lot, or maybe it's 200. But like, it's a lot. It's more than pretty much any other thing. Not like actually more than any other thing, but it's like up there. Punches do 12. I just can't find myself positioning them right with, uh... Wow, that was just not what you wanted to do, you dummy. Uh, with knockback and stuff, like, I don't know. It feels very unwieldy compared to other melee weapons. Oh, well, I guess I'm out of here. I'll, I'll bloop. CHD jump. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, that's not what I care about. Ugh. That wasn't a UHD jump. By the way. Ah. Well, I guess I won't be going the wrong way. I hate how it spawns right next to you. It gets me. But you know, on the plus side, I guess blooper's gonna bloop. I'm trying to get hit, dude. Getting hit is like my calling right now. Okay, realistically speaking, I feel the dark marker. Uh, don't go down. Yes, Ardvarkian. Have they said the release date for the Restoring 2 update yet? <laughs> like, is it today yet? What were the starting items? Convict's pistol, barrel, anti-body. It's like extremely average in every way, but like for me that's acceptable because usually my starts are kind of just bad. Yeah, I appreciate the barrel. The barrel is a good gun. We're homies. Okay. 
I knew, I was a knower. You know what, this is actually a good outcome because this way I can turn useless guns that never have ammo into guns that, into a gun that has ammo, maybe. But I also probably shouldn't. Cause like, what do I really have to get rid of? I only have, yeah, like I want most of my stuff. Uh, maybe next time then. Better to have these things and not need them than need them and not have them. Oh my god, Rhinoc, you're still alive! Thank you for the 31 months. Uh, that's not where the door is. Six King Rat is just patience. Like, that's all you have to do is not do too much damage and get three supers. That's really easy. I get three supers each round, I mean. Uh, no, no hitting the Advanced Dragon not only includes not getting hit during the BS phase with the circles where the um, Little Dragon is still shooting you because it's bad, but it also includes... Um, you know, no hitting the advanced dragon, which... Yeah, I've only done that when I've been OP enough to one-shot it, basically. So, assuming you're not including being that powerful, I don't see myself ever being able to do that. Wow, Rhinoc, I've been owned. Broke DPS cap with the Raiden coil, excuse me? What? This is some some of that 70 spice BS that I got. Well, I'm not doing that again anytime soon because I won't be able to do that again ever again. I can't believe that the blooper has gotten me all the way through bullet hell. Well, it ends here. However, that is acceptable. I just wanted to make sure I didn't, like, skip health that I could have had. It seems I didn't. Wow. Let's use this. Just so it feels loved. Look at that. It's not even breaking DPS, or it's not even hitting DPS cap. Oh, I've been owned. Yeah, I'm too, um, slow.
each cycle it gets closer to running out. Okay, it's out. What the? G-Stroy, thank you for gifting five random subs. Thank you very much for the support. Welcome and welcome back to the five of you. 160 gift subs is like a lot.